Looking to brand your vehicle, but worried about end of lease charges? What if I told you there was a way to brand your vehicle without violating a lease agreement? In this video, I'm going to break down the advantages of branding your vehicle and what your branding options are, helping you come to a decision that best suits you. Hi, I'm Richard Clark, founder of Raccoon, the award-winning vehicle wrapping company. Since 1992, we have been delivering groundbreaking vehicle projects to a wide range of corporate and prestigious clients. For over a decade, we were the authorized branding partner for the Gumball 3000 rally, wrapping and branding over 100 supercars every year. Since 2005, we've been branding the iconic Foxman's Mini Fleet with the pinnacle being the award-winning rebranding of over 350 minis inside just 21 days. Landmark firsts include the wrapping of the London Eye capsules, the first velvet Porsche wrap, the first mirror chrome Lamborghini, and the world's first matte black wrap. Today, our expertise and vehicle wrapping skills enable us to wrap vehicles of all shapes and sizes for well-known brands, corporate fleets, and startups. We have taken our skills to another level over the past few years, creating unique vehicle-based props and products to really make vehicles the star of the show. Yes, vehicle branding is one of the best ways of advertising your business or campaign. The return on investment from vehicle branding is greater than any other form of advertising from a cost perspective. A single wrapped vehicle driving into city can attract up to 16 million views a year with a vehicle rack costing just 10% of the overall price of leasing and running a van. That works out to just 87p per day and only 2p per 1,000 impressions, over 100 times cheaper than a Google ad. Generally, you have three options. You can paint your vehicle and pay an end of lease charge, paint the vehicle twice, or install the vehicle wrap. Whatever you choose to do, you must inform the leaseholder of any change, no matter how small, as you may need to re renegotiate the terms of your contract. Make sure you receive confirmation of agreement in writing or email. This is potentially the most costly scenario. You just paint it and accept whatever charge comes your way at the end of the lease. Some leases will allow paint modification, but ensure you scrutinize your contract. Lease charges can add up quickly. Painting is suitable for simpler designs, but can be very costly if you're looking at a full respray, which can range from 1,000 to 15,000 pounds. When the lease is up, you'll have to return the vehicle to its original color. So whatever you spent on the first paint job, double it because you will have to respray again. That could easily range from 2,000 to 30,000 pounds. Most businesses wrap their leased vehicles because it is more cost effective than a respray and allows for far more eye-catching designs. The average cost to wrap a car is between 1,500 and 2,500 pounds, whilst the average cost to wrap a van ranges from 1,500 to 3,000 pounds. Wrapping is not only cheaper in terms of installation, but also saves you money on lease charges down the road. This is because the wrap acts as a second skin, protecting the underlying paintwork from scratches and scuffs. This added protection helps you stay within the fair wear and tear guidelines that are a part of every lease. To put this in perspective, if you spend £2,000 on a vehicle wrap, you make a quarter of that back through avoided excess charges. There is one other advantage to this protection, resale value. A high quality wrap can be removed without damaging the paintwork, revealing a perfectly preserved vehicle underneath, an ideal scenario for the seller. As a business, this will enable you to build a stronger relationship with your lesser, enabling all kinds of perks down the road. Branding your vehicle will count as a modification for insurance purposes, and you will need to inform your insurer as to the specifics of your design. 
Certain signage can increase your rates, such as if you state you leave equipment in the van. That wouldn't do that. However, vehicles with eye-catching designs, particularly wraps, are less likely to be stolen as they are easy to track. In the case of vehicle wrapping, it's hard for a thief to remove a wrap without professional aid and it cannot be painted over. So nine times out of 10, branded vehicles will be left alone. So now you know the advantage of branding your vehicle, how much does it cost? If you're interested in vehicle wrapping and want a more specific cost estimate, why not try our pricing guide linked below? This guide gives you vehicle specific average pricing and explains the factors that can swing the price up or down. I'm Richard Clark, signing off for Raccoon. If you enjoyed the video, give us a like and hit that subscribe button. We've got plenty of great videos coming out every week. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.